feels like a summer day outside right now. Our normal high temperature 78. We're just a few degrees shy of that right now at 1115. Let me show you what's happening right now. It's actually 1117 to be precise if you're counting at home. 68 your low temperature tonight, partly to mostly cloudy skies as we head into the overnight hours. Hour by hour tomorrow, let me get right to it. We've got sunshine, we've got temperatures near 90 degrees. A chance for an isolated thunderstorm. Most of the daylight hours tomorrow looking okay. It's tomorrow night that we'll have some storms roll through Asheville to Hendersonville. Same story. We've got building thunderstorm chances late tomorrow and tomorrow night. 88 the expected high in Greenville, 88 in Anderson, 87 in Greenwood. Moving forward here, tonight's severe threat well back to our north and west. It's tomorrow that that threat gets closer to home. Look at the red area here all across Tennessee, Kentucky, and closer to home, we've got that yellow level two. That's a medium risk for severe weather, and that comes our way late tomorrow and tomorrow night. When you look specifically at the tornado threat, unfortunately, when you see this hatched area, you hear us say it a couple of times a year, that's the EF2 or greater designation from the Storm Prediction Center. That means at any given point here, not only is there a high risk of tornadoes, but there's a high risk of them being strong EF2 or greater tornadoes. So the ingredients are there for a severe weather event to our west. Now, our threats considerably lower as we go into tomorrow and tomorrow night. We'll have to watch this closer, but strong winds will be our primary threat. And then Thursday, as this system is rolling through our area in the morning, it's amplifying as it moves toward the east toward Columbia, Myrtle Beach, Charleston. Those areas will see it move through at the hottest part of the day. For us, thankfully, as of now, the timing will be at a cooler, more stable time. That said, this is still going to pack a punch as it moves through. Brand new timing here for you. We've got spotty showers into the overnight hours. Can't rule out a rumble of thunder, so don't be surprised if you hear that. Tomorrow, we're mainly dry. Here's 330 sunshine all across the upstate 90 or so. It's going to be hot. Some storms firing up across the mountains of which could be on the strong side tomorrow afternoon and then going into tomorrow evening again pretty tame. It's tomorrow night between 10 p.m. and midnight. Some storms are knocking on the door in the mountains first in the upstate. We're getting some. This rolls through quite feisty. Lightning, heavy rain, 2 a.m., 3 a.m. This is settling on down toward the south and possibly very strong as it does. Again, lightning and strong winds will be the main threat with this. I can't rule out an isolated tornado, but right now that threat appears to be quite mitigated across the area due to the time frame that it's moving in. A cooler, more stable time frame. This rolls on through as we go through 7, 8 a.m., still dealing with some thunderstorms firing up across the area through 9 or 10 o'clock. And as the day goes on, that feisty line's moving toward the east. And we have some lingering downpours through the afternoon hours. Otherwise, we're drying things back up. Put another way, let me show you the tornado risk. It really ramps up tomorrow in Huntsville up through Nashville. For us, it's still a low risk. And then going into tomorrow night, most of this tornado risk is going to be to our west. And that's the way it looks right now. We'll keep a close watch on that. It does look like we dry things out Friday going into Mother's Day weekend. Let me show it to you. The four day looks like this. Isolated severe storms, especially late tomorrow into early Thursday. Then we're slowly drying things back out Friday. Saturday and Sunday could not be more perfect. Sunshine, low humidity, cool mornings, warm afternoons near 80 degrees going into next week. Western North Carolina, you go from storms in 81 on Thursday to lows in the 40s over the weekend.